we are back with another video welcome or welcome back in today's video in my channel which is your channel we're gonna be creating this natural healthy like you just got a facial done makeup look only using Westman Atelier. If you're ready to see what's up with it, keep on watching. Mwah. I promise you guys, I'm here creating this beautiful makeup look. I'm in love with this brand. I literally, boom, fall so hard for this makeup brand that I don't even believe in guys like i just want to go back and back and back for more i don't even know what else to buy like please gucci keep coming keep coming we need more guys this makeup brand it is everything we ever wanted it's beautiful it's bougie it looks serious it's fancy and on top of that it is a clean beauty brand like what else do we want what else aesthetic of this brand in general they're very minimalistic but with a hard touch of fanciness and look serious every time you grab one of these products they feel like money they're very sheer they're more like a wash of colors very natural and that's the same natural look you're always gonna get every time you use these products Alright guys, so give this video a thumbs up if you're excited about this brand, if you are dying to try it, and if you're ready to see how I created this makeup look. Thumbs up. We're getting the same packaging for all the products. It's this beautiful soft baby pink. In one side we have Westman Atelier, Gucci Westman, and in one side of the box you're gonna find the shade of the product that is inside, so there's no confusion. The shades, they come in Roman numbers. This one it is VI. In regular numbers it will be number six. It's a medium neutral caramel undertones. They are $68. And they come with 0 0.31 ounces, 9 grams. This foundation is going to help you with the redness, to calm irritation, even a complexion, and it's going to boost moisture to your so skin. The main ingredients in the formula of these foundations are squirrelin, that that's what's going to help you prevent the moisture loss. Vitals fingersin is what's going to prevent skin shooting and calming properties. Very flux. I think that's how you pronounce the name. That's what's gonna help you with hydration and it's going to just make the appearance of your face look young. The packaging of these products, it is live. This, I find it to be so satisfying, that. The magnet in this packaging, it is so strong and steady. You can throw this wherever and you know it's going to be secure. I love the attention to detail. We're getting the logo inside and around the top. That gold and silver detail on the tip of the stick, it's everything. You know what? It's like you know she took her time designing this packaging and that means so much, guys. I don't think it gets more bougie than this, literally. Before we continue with the foundation, this is the 2020 Holiday Box. And I'm gonna be using this shade, a Nectar, and I know she just released another shade of the Lit Up Sticks. I am not sure if I'm gonna purchase that one, which I barely finish this video and I go ahead and buy it, I'm like that. But as right now, I'm thinking about it. Only because I have Nectar and this, products they're really translucent they're really bomb so if you really think about it once they're on the face it's not really gonna be that much of a difference between one and the other one so the little highlighted sticks they come in three different shades i have the nectar one that is like a classic golden peach they also have one that is a redescent a more like a clear translucent whitish color and then the new shade that is the bronze one they are $48 each and they come with 0 0.17 ounces 5 grams start by putting this on in her whole entire face like if this was a primer yes and like that it's going to look like you're not wearing highlighter it's just gonna look like it's giving you a healthy glow using this foundation brush it comes in this packaging but this it's not the same packaging of this I thought it was when I saw it in pictures but this is more like a plastic so the 
brush is $80 and it is synthetic. Handmade in Kumano. Handmade in Japan using the most traditional techniques from the most famous brush maker in the whole world. So I'll bring you closer because you know me. When you have to do the face, you have to be like all up in my face and I have to be all up in yours. Let me use the little stick and I'm gonna be applying it all around my face again. Like if we were using a primer. I'm gonna be using my foundation brush and I'm just gonna do a little bit of blending right here. All right, so I already have it all over my face. It's not that sticky. It feels really good on the skin. That is how it looks on the swatch and this is the actual color. I know from up close you can peep the shade a little bit better. Super pretty guys, super, super pretty. So now we're gonna go in with the foundation. I love that. So now we're gonna go in with this beauty right here. This is the shade of it, number six. And the magic of this foundation is that it's going to calm and shooting all day instead of covering and blocking everything up. That is the shade of it, guys. I like the match. I really, really like it. So back with my foundation brush, let's blend this out. Western you know? Atelier doesn't have a concealer, but we don't need it because we can use this foundation as a concealer, which you already know me. Of course, I already ordered two shades down. So I can use it as my concealer because this formula, it is stunning guys, stunning. Remember, this is not a first impression. I've been worn this foundation before. So trust me when I tell you it's beautiful. And this brush, it is making my day. Oh my God. I'm gonna be using the foundation for my lids and my under eyes. Guys, so look at the glow that this foundation is giving my face. Totally flawless, guys. Flawless. So if you need a little bit of extra coverage, like right here, I'm going to be grabbing a little bit with my brush. And I'm going to place it only on the spots that I need a little bit of extra coverage. Right here. It's very natural, guys. It feels good on the skin. It doesn't feel makeup-y. Like... You're not doing no harm to your skin. Is that is so satisfying? At least okay, to so we are already done with the application of the foundation. The way this feel like I don't think you understand. I don't think you understand how good this foundation feels like straight up. So we're not gonna be using no powder as of right now. We're using all creams. So. Put the powder to the side. We don't want to make no mistake. I'm gonna go with the cream contour. This it is a forty-eight dollars. It comes in two different shades. This one is the darkest one. It is Soleil Rich. It is a rich mocha, and it comes with zero point twenty-one ounces, six grams. That is the cream contour. I have a dedicated video on this. I am gonna link it in my description box in case you wanna watch it. And this will sculpt and define your cheekbones in an instant. Let me bring you closer. I need my foundation on the shade lighter for my concealer. <laughs> I want it already. And I am gonna be using the same foundation brush to blend my contour. A beautiful definition on my cheekbones yes it does have a hint of orange but it's okay I still love it and you know who I am with the contours and the bronzes that have orange on it I am not the biggest fan I'm gonna be contouring my nose also with the stick with the side of it I'm gonna be dragging a thin line guys you can do all this blending with your fingers like literally you don't need no brush to blend this uh products i just have the brush and you guys know that i don't like to use my fingers whatever is left on my brush i'm gonna place it right here on my crease 
to warm up my lid. So I have three of the stick blushes. They come in six different shades. I have Mimi, Poppe, and Bichet. Bichet is a new shade. If I'm a little blurry, it's because I focus on the blushes. So I have Poppe, that is a poppy pink. I have Mimi, it's peach, and the new shade. Uh, Bichet, it is a red berry. Poppe was the first shade that I bought. I just think that this pink, it is stunning. Let me swatch them all right here. And look at the pigmentation that these blushes have. No struggle, guys. Like literally one pass and you are done. Boom. These colors are perfect for whatever skin complexion. I like look at that. Stunning. I'm gonna guys. be using Mimi for my eyelids. So with the foundation brush, I'm gonna be grabbing a little bit of this shade. And I'm gonna be tapping it on my whole entire eyelid. Like, I just fought so damn hard for these products. Like, you have no clue. I'm gonna a little bit of a pop it. And I'm gonna dab it on the center of my lid. Flawless. I was gonna do a wing, but I'm gonna leave it just like that. Let me go ahead and apply a little bit of mascara, and I'll be back. So, I am gonna apply a little bit, like a tiny bit, guys, of my under eye powder from Pomegranate on my lids but you don't have to you can leave it like that the each is on it depends on you and I'm barely gonna apply powder I'm gonna back with my lit up highlighter and with my inner corner brush from Sigma I'm gonna be grabbing a little bit for my inner corner the little touch right there will make a difference gonna be using the new shade Bichet which I think the shade it is stunning totally worth it guys this is beautiful it is unique original I don't really have nothing like this in my collection I'm gonna be grabbing a little bit with the brush and let me apply a little bit of blush all right so that's how Bichet looks but it is buildable so I'm gonna be grabbing a little bit more because I want it to be really intense. I'm gonna be placing a little bit on my nose. Hey guys, look how healthy my skin looks. Like, honestly. I'm using my lip liner from Natasha Denona on the shade Julia. I'm gonna be grabbing a little bit of Bichette. Leave the center of your lip without it now I'm gonna be grabbing puppet for the center of my lips this pink is gonna just make your lips look a little bit more juicy hello what do you think Back with my lipstick I'm gonna be grabbing a little bit Blend it out with my finger, and I also need to put a little bit on the bridge of my nose and on the peak of my nose. I'm gonna be grabbing a little bit of my lipstick right here. I look how pretty, stunning. I have the super loaded highlighters. They come in three different shades. I have two. The rose, which is a soft warm rose, and the shade peach. They are $75 each and they come with 0 0.14 ounces for grams. I'm to place this product right on top of my blush. They are a nice framing product. They're gonna give you a nice glow, a nice definition, and a nice warm. Look at them right here guys. This is the peach and that's the rose. So for today's makeup look, I'm gonna be using this one, the rose, just because everything on my face is pinky and rose. With my Fenty Beauty brush, I'm gonna be grabbing a little bit straight off the pot. And I'm gonna be placing this right here, right on top of my blush. This is also a multitasking product. You can use it all around your face, but this is just gonna enhance your blush. Look at that. 
I'm dying for this product. This is the size that I have this, and this is the size without it, and you can perfectly see them right there. This size, it is way more like booming, intense than this one. And now, last but not least, we have the powder bronzer. I have right here the shade Soleil Rich. It comes in two different shades. This is the darkest one. And this product brings 0 0.28 ounces, 8 grams, velvety powder bronze that leaves the skin looking healthy, natural, and bronze. This is good for men and women. There's no sparkles, no glitter, no shimmer, nothing. It is completely matte look at that design they're hearts guys like i'm dying for the design i don't even want to touch it but it's just so pretty oh my god it comes in this beautiful leather pouch i do keep mine in here just for the sake of this face guys i haven't said anything yet nothing there's not a nothing of powder only in my under eyes and on my lids and literally like pff, this much nothing barely it's nothing time to bronze up her face and i'm gonna be using my beautiful brush right here you see it is not powdery at all i'm gonna be going on my forehead look how pretty <sighs> i love it and then now let's That is stunning, guys. That is a beautiful bronzer, look. This powder bronzer in conjunction with the cream contour, it looks stunning. So pretty. It does have a hint, very little of orange, but I love it. I love it. And for me to love it again, like you know how picky I am with the orange on my bronzers. Like this is bomb.com, guys. And I don't think I need to tell you nothing else. I think you already know what's up and you already know how much I love this brand. I just definitely know if you are that kind of people that you love makeup but you don't enjoy wearing heavy makeup, this is where it's at. You're gonna love and enjoy every single product in this makeup line. And layer one after the other one and all these products work beautiful together, one on top of the other one. I really think this brush was really good. I used them back to back a product after product and I didn't even wipe it down that's how good it is and that's how good all these products work one after the other one you perfectly see everything in their place it's not like everything is mixed up you see the bronzer you see the highlighter you see the blush everything nice and neat and also the products that you need if you love makeup but you don't have time to put it on if you have mature skin this is gonna look flawless on you listen i know they're pricey but they are definitely totally worth it let me know if you pick them up in the comment section down below or if you're planning on picking it up what do you think about this look do you like it you don't like it you guys know i love chit chatting back and forth with you guys Mwah! i love you all so damn much and if you're not subscribed to my channel yet i hope now you're considering subscribing so go down below click the little red button and make sure you put your notification bell on so youtube can notify you every time i upload new videos Mwah!